kids in your household any of them picky e eaters yes i yes. i wonder <laughs> if it's an oldest child thing because my brother older brother is very picky too really? and the oldest oldest child in our house picky eater huh. three-year-old eats salad yeah well, How many three-year-olds do you know that eat salad and <laughs> ask for salad? <laughs> That's a healthy three-year-old. Yes. <laughs> he eats well, pretty good variety yeah. of food. Well, I was the oldest child and... Were you picky? I wouldn't say that, no. <laughs> I'll eat just about anything. <laughs> anyway. Well, it's a good day to stay inside and eat tomorrow because yeah. we have some rain on the way. We'll take a look into that and more in just a couple minutes. Stay with us. You can be picky about your food and you can be picky about your weather because I know we really need rain. Everybody's asking for rain because it's been so dry. We would just like to not have it on a weekend. Unfortunately, tomorrow looks like we're getting rain on a weekend. And again, we need the rain very badly with the drought conditions across the Carolinas right now and the dry conditions around southeastern North Carolina. Right now, though, we're looking at clouds on the increase across the region now, some high cirrus clouds. Most of the rain still well out to our west out across southwestern North Carolina and southeast Tennessee, and that's on its way for us late tonight, some of our inland areas late tonight, into the daylight hours for tomorrow. And all that cloud cover is going to keep temperatures from going up too far, sort of like we did today. 84 and 65 for the high and low today, above normal on both accounts, 79 and 56 are where we should be on average this time of the year. And officially at the airport, 0 0.05 inches of rain, most of that late, late last night, early, early this morning. So unless you're up between midnight and about two o'clock in the morning, you missed that. And although you probably saw some of the showers and some of the wet grounds, have got out to get your newspaper early this morning. And of course, nowhere near our records for the day as well. First Alert Neighborhood Network takes you outside the Sunsbury Resort at Wrightsville Beach, currently at 72 degrees with a calm wind at that location. One more stop takes us to the pavilion at Myrtle Beach in the 70s there as well, right at 70 degrees, currently on the Grand Strand. Around the region, temperatures are generally in the 60s right now, 65 in Wilmington, 64 in Southport, down to 59 in Keenansville right now, the cool spot across the area, 70 in Myrtle Beach as well as Charleston. 60s by and large across the Carolinas now, cools off in the mountains up in Boone at 52, 61 in Asheville, and 64 in Greensboro out across the Piedmont right now. Sky forecast shows you the clouds on the increase for tonight. Could see a few showers mainly well away from the coast towards sunrise tomorrow morning over towards Lumberton, possibly up towards Fayetteville. And then the rain increases in coverage as it spreads its way eastward during the morning time hours tomorrow. Not a big rain event, at least during the morning time hours, it looks like right now. Most of the heavy rain should hold off until the afternoon hours into the evening time hours as well with some thunderstorms storms in the mix, certainly not out of the question during the daytime hours tomorrow, as well as the nighttime hours tomorrow evening and tomorrow night into the wee hours on Monday. A few showers still possible towards sunrise on Monday, particularly near the coast. But once we get into the daytime on Monday, skies start to clear out very slowly but surely, but still a lot of clouds around during the daytime on Monday and generally a mostly cloudy sky, and that's going to keep temperatures from really going up too much on Monday as well. Tonight, mostly cloudy skies, some showers possible well away from the coast late tonight. Down around 61, upper 50s inland with a west wind shifting to the northeast overnight tonight. Showers, a couple thunderstorms tomorrow, off and on heavy rains possible right around 71. Mid to high 60s inland, north to east to east winds at 5 to 15 for tonight, for tomorrow. Along the coast tomorrow, northeast to east winds at 10 to 15 knots, 3 to 5 foot seas. Water temperature at 65 now. High tide at 4.15 in the morning, low at 10.45 in the morning, and a low risk of rip currents for the area beaches. 6 plus 1 forecast, there's your clouds and cool on Monday. Once the skies clear out for Tuesday, it warms back up into the 80s and could see a couple showers towards Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, and then drying out next weekend. Darcy?